Hello guys, Papa here. Welcome back to another video. Netflix first quarter result for 2022 are out and the company has reported a mass subscriber loss, which is well below its target of adding 2.5 million subscribers and which is literally a disaster for a streaming company. And today, we will learn more about the upcoming Netflix changes and the behind the reason of for the changes. Before we go deep into it, if you are new to this channel, just subscribe and hit the bell notification button for more of the interesting videos. The number of households using the streaming service fell by 0.2 million in the first three month of the year. As it faced stiff competition from rivals, the loss in subscribers has also sparked conversations on how Netflix could look at cracking down and the password sharing on account sharing or whatever you call this which is likely impacting the revenue a lot netflix expressed to shareholders that uh, they expected to add 2.5 million net subscribers during the first quarter analytics had predicted that the number could be closer to 2.7 million during the same period a year ago netflix added 3.98 million paid users so this is really a disaster for them as they really face some issues like increased competition as well as the password sharing also the inflation and the ongoing russia invasion of ukraine so they this all of these are making a disaster the company estimates that in addition to its 222 million paying households access is being shared with more than 100 million additional households through account sharing netflix said that pulling out of russia in march in response to the ukraine war had cost it 0.7 million subscribers and another 0.6 million subscribers actually stopped using the netflix as the service in the us and canada after it put a price in january so the increasing prices is actually impacting them but these concerns are temporary as their main concern is on the sharing password so they are going to bring some changes for this major issue it will add two new features this will impact how passwords are shared between accounts as accounts are being shared between the households i mean the rules was the account will be shared between the households only add an extra member and the features like add an extra member member of a standard and premium netflix plans will be able to add sub accounts for up to two people they don't live with so this will have their own profile personalized and recommendations these sub accounts will also have their own login and password adding a sub account will come at an extra cost and for the subscriber reason i mean for the sharing password reason they actually adding this extra cost so that, that will mitigate their revenue problem i mean the loss in the revenue that will mitigate this issue and for the tracking purpose uh, transferring profile to a new account as this feature will be available to the basic standard and also the premium plan subscribers other users who share their account will have the option to transferring profile information either to a new account or an extra member sub account. Netflix said it will let users have viewing their history as also the my list and also personalized recommendations as they transfer. The idea here is to limit the number of people who can be accessing one account and this is the only way they can reduce the sharing account problem and help their revenue growth again. As these are some major changes and this will have a tons of effect in the community also. Who knows they may lose much more for these changes or rather this could be the time changing decisions from them and I think the time will say all but i think this will work anyhow and yeah that's all from today guys uh, hope you all enjoy the video and if you're new make sure you hit the subscribe button and also hit the bell notification button for more of the interesting videos see you all soon till then have fun good luck and